Hey everyone, this is Alex at Clockwork PC. It's been a very long time since I recorded something for this particular YouTube channel, but I just wanted to share something that reminds me of why I love using Linux. So, uh, I like listening to YouTube, but I don't really want to have to open a browser and all that sort of stuff. It's quite tiresome. So, there's a command line YouTube player called MPSYT, and you just run it in the terminal, and let's say you want to search for something, let's say I want to listen to some music by Max Richter, then it searches and it gives me everything, it gives me all the results of a typical YouTube search and then if you put in let's say you want to play the Blue Notebooks 3 and away it goes. Now you can configure it uh, depending on how things go, your mil mileage may vary but you get the idea, you press Q to stop, you press Q and enter to exit, et voila. Now lovely thing about using Ubuntu with GNOME Shell, which is what's going to happen after uh, 18, from 18.04 onwards, uh, ignore that, from 18.04 onwards, uh, it's going back to the GNOME Shell, they're dispensing with Unity, which uh, I'm not really too fussed about. But anyway, a very nice thing you can do is you can go to the menu editor, uh, you have to download that, but fairly straightforward, and you can create a launcher that runs in the command that runs in the terminal. So I created a launch and I just used the old Ubuntu one music icon. Why not? MPS YouTube. I'm recycling the icon. The command is MPSYT and you run in, run it in the terminal. And that's really all there is to it. So if I launch MPS YouTube, there you go, it gives me a terminal. I can do my search and there I've got the tracks and then when I'm done I quit and there you go it's closed simple as that now uh, as of as of today uh, if you sudo pip3 install MPS YouTube there is a bug that causes it to crash if you uh, search for a particular set of terms um, basically they seem to be fairly popular ones that causes them to crash it's been fixed in the development branch so if you go to the development branch of the github repository for mps-youtube go to uh, develop and clone that wherever you want to do it so I just have a folder for these sorts of things see mps youtube and all you have to do is follow the instructions so if you're not sure just type in setup.py help and you'll get the instructions you need fairly straightforward just execute setup.py with the with the switch install um, you probably have to sudo it and that's all you really need to do and that's that so just one more time I'll show it off MPS YouTube et voila all right hope this helps